One bullet is all that it takes to end the precious life of an innocent child. Two parents left standing there in the dust, holding up the lifeless form of their baby girl. Three billion annually of your taxes consistently being sent to a state constantly breaching the Fourth Geneva Convention, death, destruction, they are not bound by dimension. Five million refugees feeling scorned, six wretched days of war, seven hundred thousand civilians subtracted from their homes, eight meter high concrete walls multiplying their way through the land, dividing the territories further, refusing to lay tension to the border, rather sneaking their way between the villages, isolating them from their resources. Nine millimeters of lead being added to your flesh. Ten minutes increased to 110 minutes after the checkpoints. That's the average time it takes for an ambulance to reach a hospital in towns like Abu Dis and al -Zaria. Eleven students who spoke truth to the power of justice, recognizing the root of their struggle and embodying it within their own function. Twelve out of twelve fraction of months out of the year being lived in poverty and oppression. Thirteen killed on one side. Friendly fire cost four. Fourteen hundred irrational deaths on the other. All within a three-week war. Now, Let's take the limit, as X approaches infinite casualties, to calculate the volume of hyperbolic bullcrap your media can store in your mind's matrix. Then, graph the exponential expansion of the upper limit of profits for companies and corporations who benefit from differentiation rather than integration. Finally, factor in your decaying degrees of freedom, as well as the convoluted nonsense that your binomial politicians input while withholding the statistics that I haven't even begun to cover. And what does that equal? It equals nothing. Because equality is not a part of this equation.